my fellow humans, and welcome to Gretel and Hansel. This is a Flash game. Well, was a Flash game. I think it's been converted into whatever Newgrounds uses nowadays. A Flash game from my childhood, no doubt. Um, I have dedicated hours to this game and the second game, just replaying it over and over and over again whenever I was bored in the computer lab at school. <laughs> There's the asterisk uh, while I was at school. And, and yeah, I fondly look back on these games and it's, it's a bit sad to think that they're... Wow, Gretel. I know my intros are boring, but damn. But my, my point is, I forgot what I was saying, but my point is, is that I have a bit of nostalgia for these. Now, it has been quite a while since I've last played these games. I played them sometime in high school, and I haven't played them since. So it's been... Probably... It's been over a decade. No, it's been about a decade. Uh, between me recording this and the last time I played these games. No, it would have been slightly over a decade by the time this video comes out. Anyway, <laughs> sorry, trying to do some really basic math and failing. So, I don't exactly remember bits, pieces, answers to riddles or anything like that, but I do remember a few things here and there, and I do have some nostalgia for this game. And, uh, we will be playing the second game, not today, but in a future random horror games. By the way, this is a random horror game. Trust me. Let us begin. For a Flash game, this is like some incredible stylistic and uh, animation quality, by the way. <laughs> uh, ignore the medals, I'm not even signed in. <laughs> So yeah, our terrible, terrible mother, I would I thought she was a stepmother, but our, our mother uh, wants to ditch us in the woods so, uh, so that the family doesn't starve to death. Uh, and the father is a green, although he does have a far more optimistic idea of what will happen to us once we get to the woods. And this is our slingshot. It is our main way of interacting with the world, if I remember correctly. As you can tell, we are playing as Gretel, thusly the name Gretel and Hansel. And you're gonna see why we're not playing as Hansel in this version. Here in a second. Hansel! 
Council is a bit, um, how do I put this nicely? A bit slower than most depictions of him, to put it as nicely as possible. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so yeah, Gretel is is the 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 leading uh, sibling in this iteration. I don't remember what to do. There we go. I'll get it. I'll get it. Give me a sec. I'll get it. without Gretel. Um, oh, I, I had a word for him, but I'm not allowed to, uh, back in the day, but I'm not allowed to say that word anymore, so, um, uh, <laughs> how heavy is this rocking horse? So back in the day, I remember getting like all the achievements one time and I didn't really log in that often. So I did it like multiple times. We got a squirrel trap. I want that, give me that. Damn. A chink. Oh, whoops, I messed that up. I can see the shiny, give it to me. There we go. So, yeah, that's our goal collect 10 uh, shiny stones so we can uh, mark our path as we go into the woods. And I found an acorn. Getting the stones is not. Ooh. There we go. So we have a doll and a stick. So I'm going to show you something fun about this game. And that is, it's one of those games where you can die in like 80 different ways. I think it's seriously like 10. I remember trying to collect them all. So yeah, let's go ahead and see this death. They're pretty brutal for a flash game. <laughs> oh, they're bringing back flashbacks, here we go. If I remember right, you... Yeah, you're not sent too far back. It's you, you, there's definitely a layer of wanting to die at least just to see the deaths. Okay. 
And we'll figure that out later. Let's see here. Boop. Boop. And you got to... If I remember right, you need to... Uh, lift it up at least once. Because even if you catch the squirrel without knocking it down... Uh, wow, sorry. Even if you catch the squirrel, even when you knock it down... Um... You still have to, uh... Hit it with a stick? Get it out. Yeah, let's die and see what happens. Poor girl, too bad I'm morbid. I was morbid back then, too, if anything worse, so... Alright, let's see here. What do we have? Throw a doll at it. Throw a mush. Uh... So we need three acorns. Oh, the bees are gone. I thought I had to do something. Whoop. I could have sworn there was more screens than this. Like, I very distinctively remember... Yeah, this. Okay. Let me show you my favorite part of this game that I remember all these years later. die if you pet the rabbit. <laughs> anyway. Uh, throw a doll at the rabbit. No, sorry. Burb. Oh. Butterfly. Nope. Um... Oh! Sorry about that butterfly. Hmm. Oh, well, at least I got that then. Last acorn, ahoy! Time to murder a squirrel. That's not the way out of here. There we go. <laughs> I'm so terrified of the squirrels. There <laughs> we go. Look at that squirrel, <laughs> it's like ninja. Wait for it. Nice. Hey, look! Lunch! Aren't we all starving to death? Cool! It's... One per- um, lean meat worth one person, but you know, it's better than nothing. Honestly, this squirrel trap seems pretty effective. It's amazing that we... Well, we probably couldn't live off of it, but we could probably get a decent few meals out of it. I'm just saying. Here, let it go. 
Oh, I guess I was wrong. I guess you don't have to let it go. Hmm. See, that's how long it's been. I'm flat out re misremembering things. That's what I have. A bucket. I got another rock. So, I know this bird has one. I know there's one in the well. And I know the spider has one. I need to get closer. Bucket. Yeah. Look, look, look. There we go. I thought of it. Yeah. See? Um... So I need something sticky, right? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Honey? Is there any honey? No. Not honey. Honey? No. Hey, what you up to, little bro? Or I guess big bro? Bro? Bucket? Uh... Papers... Papers... Hehe. <laughs> Give me that. Time is running out! Oh, burn the papers? Papers. Papers. Oh wait, didn't I get another hand from the butterfly though? We need a key. Um, I'll come back. Maybe. Is there any other screens? Oh, hi. Oh, okay, okay. Um, bucket, thing, doom o'clock. Do I need to kill another butterfly? Bucket. Oh, now it works. I wasn't at the right angle. Yay. Things I don't remember that. I don't remember anything being too obtuse on this. So does that mean I'm just not on the right angle on the honey? Is that what's happening here? If I remember right... Sorry about this, buddy. Yeah! Oh my god, I remember this. I'm so sorry. I gotta show the audience, though. Yeah... You can really fuck up your brother. Oh god. Gretel, you're not supposed to show the audience your true feelings on the matter. Uh, 
Hello, was this there before? Oh, now... Did I have a glitch? I think I had a glitch. Yeah, now I can do this part. Now I got a key. Cool. Oh, I'm so sorry, buddy. some deaths if I had to be honest uh, <laughs> I just realized just now that you guys can't see my mouse you guys should be able to tell what's happening from context but yeah you guys can't see my mouse you can see the aimer though so you know you can see when I pick up items so you, you, you guys are fine I don't need to turn that on Shiny. Shiny. Yeah, I remember now. Shiny. Our brother's permanently stuck in that form. Can I catch fire? No. Why did I want to... Doll on fire? He on fire. No. Why do I want fire? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Oh, no, come back. You know what? That works. One right here. And one right here. Get stoned, baby. This part. Oh, I do remember this part, but not really. It's like random action sequence. Yeah, they double check you know how to do everything. Whoop. I missed. I'm pressing space, I'm just not good at it. Oh, this is a terrible run. Oh! <laughs> Hansel's like, yeah, yippee! No! <laughs> oh no! Let's try that again. We keep our progress, thankfully. Oh, we go to the halfway point, I should say. Damn squirrels. Damn it. Right at the end, too. Oh no, did we bug it out? Yeah, we bugged it out. Yay! Eight out of ten. Good enough.
my god, so much nostalgia, right? Dang. This hit home a little. Um, this was great for a Flash game at the time. This, you guys have to realize, this was before indie games made by one person was normal, let alone Flash, like, Flash games was pretty much all you had in terms of options. Dun dun. Yeah, we didn't get nearly all the deaths. Uh, this was like a whole bit was trying to get all the deaths. Um, but yeah, wow, I, I got some feels for these for this game and its sequel. Um, just just because I played it so much, just over and over again. Um, I loved showing this off game off to friends. You know, we would all tell each other about whatever Flash game we were able to hunt down and preoccupy ourselves with at school and all that stuff. Um, I don't think any of us even considered the possibility that Newgrounds had uh, porn on it. So <laughs> none of us ever got in trouble for that. Like, no, I'm not kidding. Not a single one of us even considered the possibility that Newgrounds had porn. Um, there was this game. The sequel, obviously, was pretty popular. Um, I think the most popular game by far was the, the original... It's not called Plague... It wasn't called Plague, Inc. yet. It was called something else, like... I think it was, like, called Pandemic or something. It was it was something very similar, but it evolved into Plague, Inc. eventually. That started out as a Flash game series. Um, in fact, I remember finding a link to the third game that would be just the third game and not like any ads or anything so we would spread that around and save it and stuff it was great it was it was just i say it was great it was a different time i should say great's a strong word it was a different time it was it, you know we didn't have cell phones that could play decent games yet you could play snake if you were lucky if you were rich you can you know download some really terrible port of some game for your phone but you couldn't play it for shit it, it, this this was the best we had and so i have a lot of like memories memories is a strong word too i just have a lot of happy feelings tied up to these games that i directly blame on nostalgia i don't even have many memories about them they're just they're just so like built into the background of other settings for lack of better words i'm not kidding we mainly played these at school so <laughs> um but yeah this this kind of these kind of games, um, I'm actually really happy I'm able to share them with you guys. Alice is Dead is another series. I don't remember what happened in them except for fish at some point. But spoilers. Uh, oh, and Alice is Dead at the very beginning. Um, but uh, I I I can't wait to share some of these with you guys. I don't want to share all of them. In fact. Even though I just mentioned Dallas is dead, I don't know if I'm going to cover it. If you guys want me to cover them, you know, tell me. But I, I don't particularly have that series on my list. It's definitely... First of all, I think I'll get in trouble for the music that plays. But second of all, um, I d it doesn't really... I don't, if I remember right, the plot doesn't really have a satisfying conclusion as far as I'm concerned. It's been a while, though. <laughs> It's, I'm not kidding. It's been a little over a decade since I was in high school, let alone since I played these. And I was playing these back in middle school, too. So um, I'm sure some of these games I haven't touched since middle school. And that that's, you know, dang. Um Oh god, I'm so old. Anyway, um, so yeah, it's it's just it's just really interesting to be able to share these with you guys. Um don't escape i think i played the first one back in the day but i don't think any of the sequels were out yet at that given moment in time so i don't think anyone i knew played those games um uh, most of the people most of my friends 
most of the guys, I should say, were interested in these action games where you played as stick figures. And um, I think I played them a couple times. I just wasn't into them. But um, games like this, like, um, oh, you look at that. Games like um, Gretel here. Oh, so you can't set yourself on fire. Uh, were what really like appealed to me were these types of games, these these point and click adventure games done in like little bite sized pieces on new grounds, and yeah, that was that was a time. I've I've spent too long on this. I hope I'm getting my my point across. All you youngins who 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 watch this, I'm sorry that you'll never experience the joy of limited access <laughs> and those of you who are my age or older i hope i brought a bit of nostalgia to you maybe you're so old that you didn't play these flash games at all maybe they were after you that's fine that you know i'm sure you got your own things but that 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 you feel the same way about either way i'm glad i'm able to share these with you guys at this point in time so yeah i think i'll call it there for today thank you guys so much for coming by Please, join me next time. I love you. And bye bye